Hi guys, good morning. My name is Morgan. If you are new here, and if not, welcome back to my channel. Today's video gives you a taste of my morning routine and what that encompasses, um, really starting with waking up, making my bed, doing meditation, doing my skincare regimen, and then when I come back, refueling with supplements and my go-to smoothie and matcha recipes. Um, every single day in my life kind of looks a little bit different, but I try to incorporate these items into my routine, even if they're at slightly different times or in a slightly different order. Um, it really does make my kind of flexible and a unique situation in terms of a job feel more regimented, and these products are all something that I use every single day and I'm excited to share with you. Um, so I'll be linking everything in the bio as well as putting the link to my smoothie recipe. So I hope you guys enjoy it and it gives you a nice little positive kickstart to your day. Turn on meditation music. Sir, the station meditation on Amazon music. Hi guys, good morning. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing my morning routine, kind of showing you 
what I do as well as showing you some of the things that I eat. So I honestly don't know which direction this video is going to take. If it's going to be more like what I eat in a day or just my morning routine. We're going to see how much I document today. Um, but I'm going to an earlier class than normal today. I'm going to a 7.15 bar class. I typically go to an 8.30 one. If I was going to the 8.30 one, I would be making my warm lemon ginger water or celery juice, something in the morning. Um, but today I don't have time. So I'm about to layer up, run outside. Luckily, it's just a couple blocks away. And head over to Exhale. Um, it's one of my favorite classes. I booked it on ClassPass, but... Working out in the morning is a huge critical part of my routine. It is important for me to have me time before I dive into work because otherwise during the class, my to-do list is just going off in my head and it's really distracting. So I prefer to have time to just zero in on myself and feel good before I really dive into everything. Um, also today after exhale, I have a follow-up appointment at Haven because our last appointment got cut short, but I am seeing them to talk through health goals and heal my body, um, heal my gut, and it's really interesting. So that's on the agenda for today, and I have work tonight, um, but I am going to be doing my usual, just working probably from home because it, the weather is not nice out today, as you can see from my sunrise, sad sunrise video clip, um, but... Today I'll just be making everything when I get back. I'll be taking my vitamins when I get back and I'm going to show you. Fun little power pony. <laughs> so, yeah, my normal morning routine is to wake up, to wash my face, kind of like put in eye drops, use my ice roller, um, brush my teeth, put on deodorant all that getting ready type of business and then meditating usually making something to drink like i just talked about and then headed out to a workout and then when i get home from my workout i will make breakfast and take my supplements and today i will make those drinks i will make a matcha i have like three drinks when i get back that i can't wait to drink Okay, so I just got home from exhale. That class was amazing. Tracy literally whips my butt every time. Um, it was so hard. All the inner thighs and glute work, but I have to say, bar, I feel like has changed my body. It's strengthened me in so many ways I didn't realize I needed. And it's so close to me. I go at least once a week. I'm really obsessed with it. I also can book it on class pass, so super convenient. Um, but now I'm going to make my morning smoothie. Um, sometimes before a workout, I might have some fruit just for a little bit of an energy boost. I'm loving mango lately and pineapple. I'm just going to show you guys the smoothie that I make every day that uses Garden of Life as well as my matcha and stuff like that. This is also when I start looking at my to-do list, um, crossing things off, and I'll also like look at the monthly outlook if I need to. This is a day designer planner and I really like it because I like having a list. I just realized why I'm sniffling and that's because I haven't taken my allergy pill yet. So I am going to do that. Um, I kind of have a whole thing of my vitamins here. I have to take one of these bad boys every day. Um, I do have a whole thing of supplements in here. Um, it's like vitamin D and probiotic and I would show you guys them, but I'm actually going to be on a new regimen through Haven. I haven't ordered those yet, so I'm kind of finishing these ones up and then transitioning into a little bit of a newer protocol, which I will show you when I have it. So I don't want to show you guys what I'm using now because it's not going to be much longer, um, but I will show you the Garden of Life vitamins that I literally die for and have every day. And that is the elderberry gummies that taste like candy 
and the women's multivitamin which I just love having a multivitamin every day and then the turmeric which honestly because it's so anti-inflammatory I feel like really makes my stomach feel well too if I were to have one after a meal so because it's an inflammatory response gummy it's gonna really soothe and feel good um, but I like taking those in the morning too If I had to vote though, these are for sure my favorite. And I wanna thank Garden of Life for sponsoring this video. As you guys know, I've been a partner with them for like eight months now. I'm obsessed with their stuff. I use it every single day. I swear by it. So I'm going to take out all the ingredients I put in my morning smoothie. Um, normally I do have a little bit more frozen, but I got this big batch of bananas the other day and none of them were ripe, so I had to leave them out. But, oops, and I just dropped them. Um, but normally I would freeze them because I like the texture that that gives the smoothie and I'll put them, I actually just ordered more stasher bags. I ordered a big one. So when that comes, all my bananas are going in there. So before I start, I want to show you guys the two Garden of Life proteins I use the most. So the raw protein and greens, which has a ton of different greens ingredients, and then the collagen protein and chocolate, um, super seed protein. So this one is plant-based, this one is not because of the collagen, but I really like the consistency and the chocolatey taste this one gives, and the fact that before I would do both of these, and now I can kind of consolidate into one. But I would still happily use either anytime. I just, with my smoothie that I make, that's very like banana-y and datey and has some greens in it, I like adding this flavor. Okay, now I know this looks crazy, um, but I have some ice in here. It's gonna be ice, banana, the collagen protein by Garden of Life, some frozen spinach. I add spirulina and maca as superfoods. I add cacao nibs on top. Um, I also do this barley grass powder. Almond milk, that's just from Trader Joe's. Cinnamon. And then I do cucumber. I just take like a cut of it. Um, sometimes I'll throw these in because they go bad quickly and I don't want to waste them. Today I'm also going to add a scoop of aloe which is also really good for digestive health, and in my case, it's just really hydrating. And then I forgot to take them out, but I will also add two dates. I don't freeze my cucumber because I use it throughout the day in salads too, um, but I am starting to think that I want to start freezing it and get two and freeze one and keep another fresh. So I might start doing that also.
You guys know me, it's not a morning routine without spills. <laughs> so I just added cacao nibs, then I add some coconut flakes. See that spill guys? It looks good, but I'm a hot mess. <laughs> okay, so that was probably the messiest smoothie making I've had and it was all documented so you guys are seeing hot mess express in the flesh the real me always um but it is so good it's so creamy I really like my smoothies thick and for some reason I mean I def definitely crave warm foods in the winter and I've been having oats a lot with the same protein but I always crave smoothies this is my go-to and I have to say Garden of Life's protein I feel so good I feel so fueled so satisfied and the ingredients are super clean I've been using collagen for years now and having collagen in my protein or separately which is I just use their regular collagen in my matcha um, I have seriously noticed a significant increase in my nail growth my hairs my skin my joints um, that's what it's good for and I'm a huge believer in collagen and that it works so well so I'm gonna put my link to my Amazon store below that is where all of my Garden of Life products can be found especially the ones I showed today so cheers it's so good and now I have to clean up I didn't get a chance to make my matcha but I will definitely be making that when I get back because I'm gonna need it especially because I woke up earlier and you guys might know I'm like a morning person but fakely so I don't love getting up early and having like an hour or two before I leave. That's just because then I know I'm going to start work, I'm going to start stressing out and I just want to have that time in the morning to just focus on me and do my workout first. Um, ideally I would have a little bit more time than I had today but I am not someone that functions well having like too much time in the morning before I head out the door. Um, so I am about to head to Haven for that appointment. Um, another product that I'm obsessed with from Garden of Life are these s'mores bars. I've talked about them so much. So just showing you guys the ingredients. They're super clean, gluten free, plant protein, and it's um, actually with brown rice. But the flavor is just so good that I love them and I eat them all the time so I throw these in my bag at all times and that is the other Garden of Life product that I truly have and consume daily um, so I wanted to show you guys that obviously I've posted about it a ton okay so I'm back from Haven and I definitely need a little caffeine boost so I actually do want to show you guys how I make my everyday matcha um, really I like I said and like I was kind of alluding to my morning routine looks different Every single day, um, especially dependent on what schedule, what's on my schedule for the day. Today was a little bit interesting that I had an early class and an appointment soon after, so I didn't have as much time to just chill in the morning like I normally do. But with that said, matcha is one of the things that I like to enjoy every single day. My hair is absolutely crazy, um, but matcha is one of the things I like to enjoy every single day along with my warm lemon water, my celery juice if I have the time to drink that first thing in the morning on an empty stomach. So. I'm going to walk you guys through the process. Um, I also have a fully charged battery now, so we are golden. I'm not gonna die on you this time. Hopefully I don't spill as much. Um, I also grabbed some fruit at the store. I kinda like to have fruit as a mid-morning snack, so I'm gonna eat some mango and pineapple along with my matcha. Okay, so I use the brand Epoto Tea. It looks like this. I get it on Amazon. I believe it's like $22. Um, it is a little bit pricier, but 
it's the best quality matcha um, that you can kind of find. I like this as well as matcha love and soiree tea which is local um so any of those just look for ceremonial japanese green tea um you just know it's legit by how green the powder is and this one is really green so i'm going to heat up some water again i put hot water and milk in it I also got more dates at the store. When I can, I buy the pitted ones because it just saves me quite a bit. And then I just can like rip them up rather than biting into it and digging out the pit. Just then I just do one powder of the collagen. These are unflavored. Honestly, collagen makes every single drink better in my opinion. I don't taste any flavor. I don't think they have a flavor. These are meant to be unflavored. There also are some drink mixes that have flavors that are really good just to mix them with water. But in my opinion, it just adds froth and so many benefits to a drink. So why not make my latte feel more like a latte and add collagen and strengthen my hair, nails, joints, you name it at the same time. do um, some maca powder and ashwagandha which is really good for calming you down so I love to have that in the morning it doesn't like calm me down where I'm like super chill it's more like just helps with some stress but if you did want that this is actually really cool and I do use this in my matcha sometimes. Garden of Life also has a collagen with CBD in it. There we go. Collagen with CBD in it, 15 milligrams. Um, and you can't taste it either, but it's really cool to have a CBD infused latte or whatever you might use this for. I put this in smoothies too. Today we're just using the regular one. But definitely recommend trying that for something new. Um, maca in. I did put this in my smoothie today too. I don't always put it in both, but I put like very little amount. I also have an IGTV of me doing my latte um, and it's on my blog so you could literally find this matcha recipe anywhere you look in regards to my sites. This is a fresh new matcha, so I am excited. I was just scraping at the bag a few days ago when I ran out of this. Um, heat. Ignore my messy Vitamix. I have to clean it. I use the heat setting.
cheers guys um i hope you enjoyed this kind of makeshift vlog of my morning routine and what i like to make in the morning and just my overall overview of my favorite garden of life products products that i use every day um i figured it would be best to show you how i incorporate them into my routine especially in the morning um obviously sometimes i have the bar or i have some of their other products throughout the day but for the most part i start my day with garden of life um and i like to start on a really positive, um, very me time type of note, mornings are really important to me. Um, even if my morning routine looks different every day, it is important for me to have that time for myself to unwind before I get the grind on. Um, right now I have a lot of work to do, so I'm gonna get to it, but be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I will have videos like this coming out weekly with the Self Care Society launch, which is launching on March 18th. If you don't know what that is, it is my five-week guide of self-care, walking you through all different types of self-care to really show you how it doesn't take a lot of time or money to give back to yourself. And it's all about that transformation and that healing transformation and just falling back in love with yourself. So I hope you guys have a good day. Um, I'm gonna drink this as slowly as I possibly can. Try not to chug it, but it's so good. And you need to make it if you haven't yet. Bye guys.